hey guys welcome and welcome back to the channel it's katrin and adobe here again with another hairstyle video today i'll be showing you all how i made this beauty right here so if you're interested in seeing the process everything i did to achieve this cutie then keep on watching and with no further ado let us dive right in <music> To begin, I'll have to prep her hair and I'll be using this cloth water as usual to spray all over her hair, massage it into her scalp, then start brushing out or combing out well, both of them. So after that, I'll start sectioning. For that, I'll be patting some slant lines here and there just so I can achieve a ponytail like pattern. If you've watched my ponytail or shuku hairstyle or any hairstyle at all that I end up, you know, having something going on in the middle, then you must be familiar with this kind of pattern. We're just going to, you know, pat everything in such a way that they are meeting at the middle that is their meeting point is at the middle and in total i have four parted lines all meeting at the middle <laughs> yeah so after that i will go in with my leave-in conditioner which is um sheer moisture i'll go ahead to apply it onto her hair comb it out then start sectioning for the trading so i'll just pat out a straight line for some reasonable amount of hair that I'll be working with and I'll go in with my shine and jam, apply it, then clear out the line, comb out and pick up four strands of Brazilian wool. Yes, so I just gave, gave a little illustration of um, how I unravel my Brazilian wool. You can do it however way you want. For the length, I really didn't take note of the length I used. I just went somewhere in between, not too long, not too short, something reasonable, if that makes sense. And yeah, I picked up four strands of the wool and started braiding onto her hair. I braid to an extent, just a little bit, and I picked up two strands and started trading did you guys see the tension test i did earlier i had to wiggle after trading for like two steps just a little bit i had to wiggle to make sure that it wasn't tight to the roots which is very essential when it comes to trading hairstyle please take note of that like i literally do this for every of my trading hairstyles if you haven't noticed now you know so moving on to this next one i repeated the same process i did with the first one just pat out a straight line comb out braid with four strands of the brazilian wool for a bit and started trading with two strands to my desired length and tie a knot so these first two are the only ones i will be braiding before trading for the rest i won't be doing that anymore and that is because these are like a foundation of how the rest of the hair will turn out i've kind of explained this a couple of times in the rest of my trading hairstyle but i i will still go over it again that is if i can <laughs> if i can do the explanation like i said they are foundation of how the rest of the hair will turn out you guys will see what i'm talking about so as you guys can see this third one all i just did was started trading with two strands of the wool and i traded for like two three steps then i added the first one we traded to it and started trading together and this fourth one i would trade for like two three steps and add the second one that <laughs> we already traded to eat then start trading together so you guys now see why i said they are foundation to how the rest of this hair will turn out here so one thing to note with this style is you have to make sure they are all in same line like you have to make sure that your brushing game is tight you're gonna be brushing from down and up to the middle making sure is equivalent to the previous one like everything is in the same line not one moving to one side and the other one to, like everything is, is in the same line like you're trading are all in the same line without being i don't know if you guys are getting me but hope i'm making sense though Sure you guys are seeing how beautiful this whole stuff is turning out they are all in the same line yes this is what happens when you brush everything to the middle making sure you're following through 
one line one after the other so yeah i'll just continue with this process use two strands of brazilian wool thread for like two three steps then add the previous one or the two like <laughs> yeah you guys get what i'm saying add to it thread together if you've been watching my channel if you if you're an og on this channel well not really kind of an og yeah but if you've watched like two three trading hairstyles on this channel then you probably know this cheney trading because i've done cheney trading a couple of times on this channel yeah so i'll just keep calm and allow you guys to watch i mean this is the last one anyway it's not like there is any more thing to show here so this is the last one i will repeat the process and then i will add the remaining one so that there will not be anything left i mean it's the last one we we'll just add both the extra trading to this particular one then trade together till i get to my desired length so once i've traded to a preferred length i'll go ahead to tie it out securely making sure it doesn't unravel and i'll cut out the excess with a pair of scissors then i proceeded to bond the ends but unfortunately my lighter wasn't lighting <laughs> as you guys saw so if you're doing this make sure you bond the ends and after that i went ahead to tuck in the ends of this trading into the second trading we ever did on this hairstyle that is the beginning the second one in the beginning and i started wrapping it around tie a knot making sure it doesn't unravel and you guys you can't even tell the beginning of this style you can't tell by a man looking at it it just look a form of like a basket if that makes sense just something very beautiful and classy you can hardly tell where this whole trading began and see how my baby girl is stretching and yawning because she's tired of course next i went ahead to start brushing in her hair laying down her edges which is very essential and i also went ahead to oil her scalp with this diy moringan oil a video of how i made it will be coming up soon so look out for that and you guys look at my baby girl <laughs> see how beautiful this hairstyle looks it looks so unique so you guys let me know what you think about this style will you be trying it out on your little one or will you even as an adult try out this style let me know what you think and one thing i'll promise you is this hairstyle takes little to no time like i literally made this style in less than an hour on the day i made this hair i had no intentions i had no plans of making adobe's hair the idea just popped in my head in the evening and i went ahead with it in an hour we were done with it so go ahead and recreate this style tag me on ig and i will definitely we post it and with that we've come to the end of this video if you were to this point why not give this video a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't shared this video and see you in my next one bye bye